again, uh, welcome to another video of Bolo Pro. Thanks for tuning in again. Um, I want to talk with you again about the Chinese language, how to learn the Chinese language best. I already um, made a video about um, my experiences um, of how I learned Chinese, how I started and how I continued learning Chinese uh, for more than six years. And I also already published some videos about um, my student life experiences in China and published them a couple of months ago, check them out. Uh, but today we want to talk about the difficulties um, that you might get into when you start learning the Chinese language. Um, the difficulties and challenges. The Chinese language has more than 6,000 characters of which many look the same or at least similar. Um, even worse, the Chinese language has only 417 syllables which means that for some syllables um, you have that more than a hundred characters for one syllable. So a hundred characters um, that all have a different meaning and are pronounced nearly the same. Um, which leads to epic tongue twisters like the following. So that's totally crazy, like you cannot understand how you can learn a language like that. And if you hear Chinese people talking and you learn some words, you will notice you don't understand a word. Because everything sounds the same. How do you learn a language like that? And how do you distinguish the words if they are just so few syllables? Um, not all of these 400 syllables are being used. So the differences are in the tone and in the context, I mean in the like situation that the words are being used. From, from those things you can tell what the, the word or the syllable means. <clears throat> so until today, like the tingly, the understanding of the Chinese language is my biggest weakness in the, uh, my language skills. And um, we, wa we want to work on that. There are many tools that help you today to get, get, uh, um, get along with these difficulties. And um, I will explain you in my next video um, why still Chinese learning the Chinese language, especially the basics, is actually very easy and uh, why they are very good tools um, compared to earlier days of approaching these difficulties, um, of having so many words that sound the, sim sound the same and look the same, but um, you can really go into it systematically and solve these problems. Problems. You have to imagine uh, a couple of years ago when I started learning Chinese and I wanted to look up a character, I really had to use uh, like a dictionary and the dictionary is ordered by, by the number of strokes in one character that takes like two to three minutes minimum to find the character and then you only have one character, you don't even have a whole word yet. So that's crazy and I was not able to learn the Chinese language fast. Now you have Google Translate you know, on a decent level, many softwares, apps, websites and we get into this together. Um, stay with me. Um, tell me what is the most difficult part on learning the Chinese language for you. I really want to know what are your plans? Are you planning to go to China and um, attend a, a Chinese language course? Um, I'm really curious and um, thanks for staying with the Bobo Pro family. Subscribe to see some more of our videos and um, see you next time.